What is up, fam? Welcome back to Leslie Jones Tarot. This reading here is for my Scorpio Zodiac signs. Let's dive in and go ahead and see what other messages we can get out for you, okay? So, let's start with the soul's journey. Spirit, what is going on with my Scorpios? Oh, and y'all, I meant to make the announcement. I went to go check for that other TikTok, the one that was like doing the scams and stuff, and y'all, I couldn't find it, so... I guess it got deleted. I don't know. But from what I've seen, I can't find it anymore. So, loneliness popped out. Okay, but I'm putting it back because I was talking. What's going on with Scorpio? Scorpio's energy. What are the messages that Scorpio needs to know? Oh, look at the baby kid. Messages for Scorpio. We have grief. I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. Bottom of the deck, imagination. I embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my mind. So somebody's grieving you? Where's my other chapstick? Because this is just not... Ugh, where is it? I hate this chapstick. Oh, I, like I hate the way it tastes and everything. Like, the way it smells. Ugh, I don't like it. I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. Okay, so somebody feels like they lost out on something. Now this could be you, somebody around you, your person, your friend, your family. Let's see. Clarify this grief energy for Scorpio. Oh, I just seen the emperor. This is grief energy for Scorpio. The star. Let me cover her up because her tie tie is out, honey. The star. <laughs> All right, so somebody's choosing to heal or somebody's healing. Some of y'all could be dealing with an Aquarius because that's what the star card is about. Mm. So somebody is choosing to heal or wanting to heal or somebody is healing. Somebody could still also have hope. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles. And something's going to work out. Or somebody's hoping they can put... It's like somebody's staying positive. I normally don't have my cards. Normally all of my cards are in the upright. So that's... And I only take reversals if they come out that way. But for some reason, this one's in the reverse. So we have Page of Cups in reverse. And Page of Pentacles. So... Somebody could have been immature or insecure about something. <clears throat> Somebody may want to like prove their loyalty or like come in and offer something like some sort of plant, some sort of seed. Okay. With this page of pentacles showing that they're dependable, that they're reliable. Somebody may want to, like, start laying a foundation. It's a page, but I mean, you know. Somebody may be younger than the other here. Somebody has a goal. Like, they, they see a goal. They want to come in. They're being hopeful that they can come in and offer this or message you or plant some sort of seed, start something. You know, give, give you something that you can touch, taste, feel, see, you know, tangible. And invest in you in some sort of way. It, it may start off as the page, but their plans is to turn into the eight, okay? So, tell me about this energy for Scorpio. Somebody's breathing, though. Like, maybe somebody was too immature to plant or... Somebody was so immature that all they gave was the page. Maybe you were given eight of pentacles. This person was only given a page. You know, it wasn't equally yoked. What's the grief? And it could just have to do with immaturity. What's the grief card? Some of y'all dealing with a damn air sign. <laughs> Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Some of y'all definitely dealing with an air sign here bottom of the deck moving change of residence moving in with your partner somebody wants to move in with you or move forward in some sort of way 
This is somebody that wants to come together. Oh, you feel like you needed, you were being either protected from this person by higher up, by like um, an ancestor or something. You was being protected because somebody was unavailable. Is that the wind? That wind is strong. Honey, I'm about to close the blast because it's starting to get dark out there. Honey, I don't do the dark now. <laughs> I don't do nighttime. Mm -mm. Nighttime is not for me, baby. I don't like the dark, baby. Um, a lost loved one watches over you. Someone is unavailable. Waste of time is over. Somebody feels like somebody could have been um, emotionally unavailable at the time, and that's why somebody is kind of like grieving here because it's like this is somebody that lost out on the opportunity with you because they weren't willing to open up, you know. Uh, maybe y'all had talked about moving in together or like coming together. Look, water sign, gambling, child. Right? This could be somebody that you had a baby or wanted a baby. There could have been something about like a risky pregnancy or somebody felt like it was a risk. Or somebody was willing to take this risk because we got pregnancy and then gambling. Somebody knew it was like risky, but somebody was... Wanting to take this risk, like they were listening to their intuition or they were in their feelings or their emotions. You could be dealing with another water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Uh, or somebody was wanting to take this risk. Somebody could have also had issues with like finances or addictions in some sort of way. Somebody was emotionally unavailable and you were being protected. Like if all of a sudden, like y'all stopped talking, you and another person or um, there could be something with communication because air sign energy is about communication, intellect, logic. <clears throat> Somebody could be in their head or wanting to communicate. Ooh. <clears throat> You got passion in reverse. Did you lose passion for this? Lose interest for this? It says very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Somebody couldn't decide. Somebody could have been very indecisive. Maybe they took a little too long on making up their mind on this or something. Child. Oh, Chile, honey. Did somebody miss the boat? Woo. Somebody couldn't make their mind up because somebody was stuck in their emotions. Yeah, pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. Yep. Okay. So, somebody, maybe somebody was ignoring the red flag, but your spirit guides weren't. <laughs> Okay, your ancestors was up there like, mm -mm -mm. no, 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 we're not going to go in that direction, okay? And now that could be the reason why somebody wants to heal things here or is trying to be hopeful about a situation. They're hoping that they can get some sort of like renewal. Mm. Then we have chemistry. So yeah, somebody's still like, there's a strong magnetic attraction here. Who, child? Somebody is, like, really attracted to you. But y'all are in separation. Time apart from your partners on the horizon. Y'all are apart from each other. There's some sort of separation. Y'all took some time apart. You went your way. They went there or something. But there was some chemistry here. But there was something about red flags. Child, I'm going to be nosy. What's going on? But um, somebody grieving you because of the past. This is this is a person that has already lost you, okay? Or you lost them, whichever. But I'm taking it from Scorpio's side. Um, this is a person that already lost you. But they're hopeful that you will either communicate with them or you're thinking of them. What's, what, what's this energy, honey? What's this energy? 
What's this energy, Holy Spirit? You don't want to talk to him. You don't want to talk to this person. So this would be somebody that you don't want to talk to because there's no more passion there. I don't think you're attracted to this person anymore. You got recording, announcement, expression, uh, revealing. This person may want to reveal something to you, express something to you, or make some sort of announcement or something. This person could also have like a, a, a recording of you, a video of you, or a voice recorded or something. You you got don't want to hear it. You don't want to hear what this person has to say. This person may call you. Okay. Love story. Once upon a time. This person wants to express their love for you. What's going on, child? So we are dealing with a player or this person plays games because we have arguments putting them in their place. So you could have gotten into an argument with this person or you're going to get into an argument. I don't know. Okay. And then you got the caught up card. Finding evidence, getting caught and cheating. You could have caught this person cheating on you. And that's the reason why. You know this person's a player. They play games. Why the fuck are they contacting you then? <laughs> you know this person to play games. I hate nothing about you. Great actor putting on a show. Over it. Tired of drama. This person puts on like they okay. They put on like they over the drama, like they ain't got no hate against you. But this person actually do, they feel some type of way about you. I ain't even gonna lie, like they mad. <laughs> but they put on like, I don't hate you. I got love for you. No, I don't want the drama. No, they want all of it. They want all the smoke. They want the drama. They they can't stand you. <laughs> this, this, uh... This person wears a mask. Whoa. What happened to that? Okay. Caution. This person that come in like they cool with you. Like, yeah, I just want to heal things. You know, I just want to be positive. I just want to end on a good note, right? Uh-uh. This person wants some smoke. This person want to start some shit. That's what this is. Won't you lay? What I tell you, anger management. This person's pissed. I don't know who this is to you, but they're pissed. And why are they pissed? Because you no longer have passion for them. You you don't want um, anything to do with them. Child, how does person feel? Because that just went left to you. How does this person feel towards Scorpio? What's this person's feelings? They want a new phase with you. They want to rekindle things. Okay? They want to change your mind. All right? They also feel like you done like rose up from this. Like you done went through this death and rebirth and you doing your thing. And you rising up from the ashes like ain't shit happened. Like you, you acting unbothered, right? With the phoenix here. They feel like you're stable, you're secure, you're growing, and you're you're uh, enduring. But this person also wants to grow with you, and and I don't like this. Something's wrong with this person. Um, they feel like you can help them be stable. They feel like you're the secure the secure opportunity. I don't. We have performance on here, and then like that great actor, like this person. They may come in and act like they're stable, but they're not, y'all. This person is not. 
death. The relationship is over. No second chance is growing. Transform what's dead is dead. You feel like this is dead, or this this person even feels like things are dead with you. But they want. They're hoping they can change your mind. Why? I feel like this person only coming back though, because you were the secure option. Like you've grown and like. <laughs> Hold on, y'all. What's this? In? How, what, how does person feel towards Scorpio? Wait a minute. How does person feel towards Scorpio? There could have been a third party interference. This person's attracted to you. They like your sex. Because we got the seduction part. Okay, if you had sex with them, they like your sex. Um, if you didn't have sex with them, they want to have sex with you. Okay. Uh, this is a temptation. They want to hook up with you. They're attracted. Why am I getting my, why is my face wanting to go? <laughs> why is my face wanting to do that, Scorpio? Why do I feel like this is somebody y'all don't want to hear from? Oh, I'm sorry, girl. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Love call. They want to come in and express how they feel. They want some sort of communication to let you know that they're thinking about you. What, what, how, how does this person feel towards Scorpio? They got. They look at your pictures. So the announcement expression revealing this person, they think about you. They look at pictures of you, old pictures of you, old messages of you. They're very nostalgic about you here. Oh, they want to make new memories with you. Ooh, Chile. Ooh. Ooh. This person could deal with addictions. Um, they could have been codependent, obsession, obsessive. Uh, could be a little possessive and controlling. They can deal with like emotional blockages as well. Tell me one more. How does person feel towards Scorpio? Chile. How does person feel towards Scorpio? Ooh, ooh. This person feels like you stabbed them in the back. They feel like you might have lied to them or you were deceptive in some sort of way because we got backstabbing. You broke their heart. You could have done something that was like out of nowhere, like your cut off or something like that. Like it was out of nowhere and they feel that they feel like you betrayed them or stabbed them in the back. Or they could have did this to you, honey, but that this is how they feel. Okay, this is how they feel. The mask card, they hide how they feel about you. They pretend like they okay. I don't like this person though, because they they tend to gaslight. They hide a lot of emotions behind the mask. That could be what that uh, great actor was, too. Like, they hide a lot. But this person feel like you stabbed them in the back. <clears throat> this person may be a liar. Or they feel like you're a liar. Whichever. Why the backstabbing? See, I'm nosy. Why backstabbing? Why the backstabbing energy? Why, why do they feel like that towards Scorpio? Why the backstabbing energy towards Scorpio? Why the backstabbing? Because they fell in love with you? Out of nowhere, struck by love. They feel like they fell in love with you out of nowhere. They had faith in the situation. They felt like... Oh, God. Competition and enemy. The other woman look over your shoulder. If you went towards somebody else, for one, for, for one, they think you with somebody else. Two, um, they feel like you made them compete for you or, oh, I don't like this. <laughs> Not the snake. They feel like you either put them in competition or... Y'all enemies? There could have been another woman involved. Or another masculine involved. Ooh, child. If you, if you broke up with them and, like, you moved on. 
people was like, oh, I'm going to have faith and love. They feel like you betrayed them by doing that. Honey, clarify backstabbing with Cupid's arrow. Clarify that. Backstabbing with Cupid's arrow. What the fuck? Keeping you a secret. For some of y'all, this person wanted to like keep you a secret. Like they didn't want nobody to know that they was fucking with you. And they was hoping that y'all could ride it out like that. Like by you staying a secret, you not being known. Like, if you revealed yourself or something like that, they, they feel like you betrayed them by doing that. Oh, child. Oh, God. Running away, outdated, and envy. Or maybe they kept a secret. For some of y'all, they feel like you kept somebody a secret or they either kept somebody a secret. Something about, like, you were supposed to ride it out with them. Like, you were supposed to love them and ride it out. Even if they cheated or they stabbed you in the back, whatever. You were supposed to ride this shit out with them, okay? But instead, you ran away, you discarded them, and now they envious. Child, this is bitter, is what I'm getting. This is somebody, they, they missed out on the opportunity with you because... Why, why are they grieving, spirit? Why the grief card? Because they didn't want you to kick them to the curb in reverse. They they grieving because they want to come back. But this person's full of drama. For some of y'all, this person does drugs or like they're very overindulgent. Ooh, something about the police and family. This person could like, you could have had to call the cops on this person or they could be having issues when it comes to like family and shit like that. Like, child, this, this seems like a headache. Setting the record straight, fighting for what you love. They want to like come in and let you know they want to fight for you. Or they're grieving because you didn't fight for them. They feel, for some of y'all, they feel like you the player, Scorpio. I ain't even gonna lie. They feel like you the player, like you played them. They feel like you didn't fight for them. Like, I don't know. Cause I'm about to, I'm not going to say what I was going to say because I don't want to hurt nobody's feelings. But they feel like you didn't fight for them, okay? That's how they feel. Can't help how they feel, y'all. <laughs> I don't know. Flip it, reverse it, turn it over, whatever. Flapjack it, whatever. <laughs> Any other message? <laughs> Follow your heart's desires and manifest the heck out of your life. I feel like you just kind of manifest in your life, Scorpio. That's what I feel like. I feel like you manifest in your life. And I know the cards be backwards on the phone. I'm sorry, y'all. I apologize. I don't know how to flip it around, honey. Everything you need, your courage, strength, compassion, and love, everything you need is already within you. I feel like you loved yourself enough in this situation. That's why you walked away or you just kind of let it be. Um, this person here, they want, they want you back. I don't know who cheated. Somebody cheated. And somebody got caught. And they feel like you were supposed to ride that shit out with them. Or they thought they was going to ride it out with you. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to leave there. Scorpio, <laughs> this is what I have for you. Hope it brings you clarity and insight. Appreciate y'all so much for watching. Catch y'all in the next video. Bye, y'all.